Hey everybody, let's talk about elbow position during the push-up. So, a couple different things. It goes with the hand position a little bit. If I have my hands underneath my shoulders, I want my elbows tucked in to about 45 degrees from my side here. See, I'm right about here. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, if I have a wider grip, my, my elbows come out with them. Okay, I'm generally never looking for 90 degrees. It puts a lot of pressure on the top of the shoulder. Most people don't do really well with it. I'm also not really looking for a uh, tuck right into my sides. It helps me be stronger. It helps me use my lats to help push me out of the push-up or out of the bottom of the push-up. But as I come in, as I come down, my shoulder has to tilt forward and it destabilizes the front of my shoulder joint. So I generally would not recommend that. Um, you're looking for, you know, anywhere 45 to 60 degrees usually is the sweet spot. Now, uh, what else are we uh, looking at? If you have something where you're a little cockeyed, where one is out and one is in, um, just try to make them even. That's generally the cue that I'm doing. Uh, also, look at your um, positions when you're doing other exercises. Make sure you can feel them pretty similarly from side to side. So when you do like a split squat, I want you to try to make one side look and feel the same as the other side. Generally, if I do it with my right leg forward, I notice my right shoulder comes down a lot. But if I do it with my left leg forward, my left shoulder doesn't come down as much. So I try to exhale, get the air out of the way, let that shoulder sink down, and then I can kind of get in. It still feels kind of different, but it at least looks the same. Okay, so that's my, uh, my recommendation for elbow position during the push-up.